White House face plants doing damage control after migrant death disaster. Well, it's, it's crazy. This is what happens when you have open borders and you just let anyone into this country with no, no checks and, and just letting them in and stuff like this is going to continue to happen. And unfortunately, I think it's going to get worse. But before we get started, go ahead, hit that like button, share this out so we can get this information out there. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber and hit that alarm bell so you know when I'm putting out new stuff. Also, check out my link tree in the description. It has a link to my Patreon where I talk about things I can't talk about here. And um, there's also a link to my merch store. All right, let's talk about this news. On Tuesday, an abandoned truck with roughly 100 illegal immigrants was discovered outside of San Antonio, Texas, and at least 46 people inside were dead. Many are blaming Joe Biden and his open border policies for this tragedy, and the White House is responding the only way they know how by lying. Answering a question about the White House's response to criticism of Biden for the tragedy, Press Secretary Karen Jean-Pierre first tried to deflect by pretending to be concerned about those who lost their lives and their families. Quote, so 46 people died, right? And in the state of Texas and so and others, as I mentioned, are still fighting for their lives, she said. So we're we're still learning their names. Their families are still learning they lost loved ones. And when a tragic situation normally happens, after that, she insisted that the White House uh, wants to hold human smugglers accountable before serving the biggest whopper you've ever heard. Quote, but the fact of the matter is the border is closed, she said, which is in part why you see people trying to make this dangerous journey using smuggling networks. I mean, it's so dis it's just so disingenuous um what the border is closed does anyone want to tell uh that to the countless number of illegal immigrants heading to our southern border right now or the illegal immigrants who are being housed in government facilities or quite literally shipped to other states in the in the country's interior we've been uh reporting on biden's border crisis for since since he's been in office and now for the first part, um, and now for the, um, for the most part, and the people in his administration have been in denial that a crisis is even occurring. Do they really think that pretending the border is closed will make us forget that illegal immigrants are flooding into this country at historic levels? Instead of digging, uh, instead of uh, digging themselves into a deeper hole, the White House needs to resume building the wall I don't think that's going to happen. It's too much pushback from um, from their side, even though e most most um, most immigrants here that's here legally that did it the right way. They don't want the borders open. They don't want people to flow in without being checked and all and all that other stuff. It's it's crazy that they allow the the left is is allowing this to happen. I mean, but and the crime is going to continue to go up and stuff like this is going to continue to continue to happen until we get these people out of office that's destroying our country. Um, but let me know what you think. Leave your comments down below. Like, share, and subscribe. And check out democrepublics.com for the latest in news. Until next time, peace.